Hey everyone, this is Sean, and what I'm about to show you today, it will absolutely blow your mind away, okay? What you are seeing here, this is not the, the Windows start screen, no. This is Xbox One on the Surface Pro 3, wirelessly, okay? So let me just show you really quick. Uh, this is the Halo 5 multiplayer beta, just as an example. Okay, so I brought my Surface in here into the laundry room just as an extreme example of how you can really take this anywhere. If you want to play Xbox One and you have this setup with the Surface Pro 3, uh, you can take it into your bedroom, in bed, you can take it into the laundry room, the kitchen, wherever you, wherever you are in the house, um, you can take it and you can have access to gaming. Now there are three epic things about this setup that you need to know. Okay, first of all, you don't have to be connected to the Xbox One via wires, okay? You can have this anywhere. Now, the second thing you need to know is that you don't have to have the controller connected to the Surface Pro 3. This controller can be wireless. Now, the third and most important thing is that there is no perceivable lag. Okay, so this is the pure signal up here in the Xbox One, and this is the transmitted signal to the Surface Pro 3. So you can see uh, very little lag. Uh, this is an example. Now when I'm playing games on this, I don't notice any negative impacts to the gameplay at all. Everything seems very smooth, very responsive. You probably will not notice any lag at all. Now one other thing that I should actually also mention is that audio comes through the Surface Pro 3 when you have this setup. You can make it so the audio comes out of both, uh, but you can also make it so that audio comes through the Surface Pro 3. Okay, so that was the demo for playing Xbox One on the Surface Pro 3. Now many of you are asking, but how? How is this done? And that is exactly what I'm gonna show next is all the components that are required to make this work. Okay, so I tried to separate things out a little bit so you can kind of get a sense of what's going on. Um, I'll show these components uh, separately in a moment. But basically the key component is this one right over here, which takes an HDMI signal and allows you to view it in your surface through USB. And that device is called the Avermedia Extreme Cap U3. Now, I looked at a ton of different uh, HDMI capture devices. Many of those uh, other ones that I looked at are geared towards game, uh, recording games. And so there's a three to five second lag that nobody cares about. Uh, but this device is one of the few that has almost zero lag, as you saw in the demo. Uh, so this is why this particular Extreme Cap U3 uh, works well. Now everything that I'm going to show, I put links on my video description. So if you want to check them out, uh, read up a little bit more about them, uh, just go to my video description and click on the link to see these uh, devices on Amazon. The other uh, component is this one right over here. That's an HDMI splitter. It, it splits the signal so you can see it on your TV or on your Surface. But what I found is that it's actually necessary uh, because for some reason the signal is blocked going from the Xbox to the Extreme Cat. Some sort of like protected signal or encrypted signal, something like that, and this removes it. Now, I also showed in the video a demo of doing this wirelessly from anywhere in your house. And for that you need something like this. Okay, so here I have a transmitter and receiver. Uh, these come in all different shapes and sizes. The particular one that I got is the IO Gear Wireless HD Digital Kit. So a little bit complicated, but you know what? This is epic. The fact that I can take my Xbox anywhere and use my Surface as a screen for my Xbox uh, and not even have to have it tied, be able to do it remotely anywhere from anywhere within the house, that is absolutely epic. That is mind blowing. All right, so there you have it, the Xbox One on the Surface Pro 3. I'd love to hear your thoughts about this video. Uh, be sure to like this video, share this video, and thank you very much for watching today.